Two people have been arrested and charged with murder in a busy afternoon shooting at a Shell gas station in Albany on Friday, February 9th. Those individuals have been identified as 23-year-old Cameron Jackson and 24-year-old Aaron Santris Edwards III. Today, residents tell WALB's Fallon Howard they still feel safe in the Good Life City, but they do hope individuals can learn better conflict resolution skills. And that there is Cameron Jackson, who has been charged and arrested. And the following person would be Aaron Edwards III. Now we take it to Fallon Howard, who spoke with residents and what they say about this shooting yesterday. It's, it's very disappointing. It's very disappointing. This is uh, 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 supposed to be a community that we can raise our families, we can grow and live. Many people that I spoke with today tell me that they still feel safe in Albany and do not have any concerns relating to the shooting. One resident believes that a lot of these incidents are personal. It's a safe neighborhood. I mean, the city overall is safe. You know, I just believe that, you know, sometimes, you know, people get into it a, a little more than they should and uh, carry it out into the streets. But usually it's isolated to, you know, some people that have issues between each other. According to the police report, the shooting occurred after an altercation between three males that were inside of the Shell gas station on Old Dawson Road. One of the males went back to his vehicle before the other two males came outside of the store, which led to the shots being fired. Tracy Taylor witnessed the shooting himself and says shootings are becoming more repetitive in the community. For tragedy and sad thing about it, that it a reoccurring thing right now. Um, I just got finished eating with my family and heading to the house and noticed all the polices at the convenience store. Lord and behold, come to find out another shooting. 23-year-old Kevon Hardy succumbed to his injuries at Phoebe Putney and Jackson is in stable condition. More charges are currently pending for the suspects, but they are in custody. Those who have information about the incident are encouraged to contact Crime Stoppers at 229-436-TIPS. Fallon Howard, WALB News 10, your hometown news source.